Good morning guys. Here I'm walking in the forest in the morning and I'm confused about something, about what some of the AI influencers are saying about O3. They are hyping it. It's a new model. It's smart. It's probably the smartest model we have out yet. Uh, but yeah, there are some questions about cost of the smartness. But they are hyping that it did something that no model did before. And what it did is that it has ability to call tools inside of its thinking process. And I'm confused about that. How is it different from what GPT-4 could do in 2023, when Code Interpreter was released? Back then, in ChatGPT, you could ask a question, GPT-4 would decide to write Python code, run it, see results of that run, and react to them. For example, if the run failed, it would react by trying to fix it. And if run succeeded, it would take a look at results and may decide to write some more code. So you can give it something like CSV and then uh, ask it to analyze, to answer questions. And it will try, it may fail, and it will try again. This is something that was happening from 2023. So how is O3 different? Because in the end, this is just a stream of tokens. And some of those tokens should decide to make two calls, return something that turns into tokens, and influence next tokens. So, is O3 different? Yes, but not for that reason. It maybe was trained to do better at this, and it does better at this probably, but it's not a new thing. It's old thing, as old as 2023. Maybe I'm wrong, maybe I don't get something, what do you think? Share in comments.